Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Atus. In this video, I'll be showing you how to transfer Wix website to client. Before we start, hurry up and check out our latest software just under this video. So let's get started. In this case, how do we transfer ownership on our Wix website? Well, the first thing you need to do here is you need to go to your admin page. Now from here, access settings at the left uh, bottom here of your site panel. And from here, look for the option that says roles and permission. Go ahead and click on it. Now, what we need to do is we need to look for the current owner, which is our name right now. So let's go ahead and click on change owner. And from here, we need to enter the other email address that you want to invite and become the owner for this one. So for example, I'm going to invite my other email here. And from here, let's go ahead and choose a few things. So what would you describe them as? So for example, you want to indicate that they're a client, agency, or freelancer, or someone else. Let's go and click on continue. Now, you have an option here to keep you your role as a co-owner for this site after the transfer and as well as create a copy of this site and keep it in your account if you want to. So, for example, I'm going to actually uh, keep my role as a co-owner here and click on continue. Now, in this case, this will actually send an invite to that specific co-owner or that specific user. So, in this case, you'll remain a co-owner for the site after transfer. So, in this case, you need to also confirm that you understand when you transfer your site. The following interest will be transfer. Uh, the following interest will be the new owner. So, if you understand that, click on transfer ownership. That's going to say transfer invite sent. So what we need to do next is we just need to wait for the client to receive it. Now in this case, this is the other email that I actually invited. So typically they will receive this email here and what you need to do is, or what they need to do is they just need to click on accept transfer here. And from here, it's going to actually accept that and they just need to log in into their account. So I'm going to log in via my Google account here to make things a lot faster. But in this case, once they are logged in, they should be able to accept the actual invitation. So you can see it's now loading the dashboard and that should actually say is, uh, or actually said transfer success. So in this case, uh, as you can see, when we go to our Wix website here, we should now be able to see the website that was transferred to us. So yeah, so in this case, we now have this website here, as you can see right now. now from here, let's go and go back in here, click on got it. From here, let's just wait for it to reload and we should now be able to see the updated list of users. So as you can see, client is now the uh, current owner for this one. As you can see, there are they are now the owner. But in this case, you are still a co-owner here since we actually added or used the uh, keep yourself as a co-owner. But yeah, so that's about it. So this one's pretty easy and if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.